economic sentiment of the market and banks and popular culture, yes, it's a foolish investment, but uh, everyone's wrong. <laughs> what? That's a good one. <laughs> this is Wall Street, Dr. Burry. If you offer us free money, we are going to take it. My one concern is, is that uh, when the bonds fail, uh, I, I want to be certain um, of payment um, in case of solvency issues with your bank. I'm sorry, are you for real? You want to bet against the housing market and you're worried we won't pay you. Yes, that's correct. <clears throat> Dr. Berry, we could work out a pay-as-we-go structure that would pay out if the bonds fail, but it would also apply to your payments if the value of the mortgage bond goes up. You'd have to pay us monthly premiums. Is that acceptable, Dr. Berry? Yes, yes, yes. Um, I have prospectuses on six mortgage-backed securities all on shore. Dr. Berry, these should be fine. Yeah, we're prepared to sell you five million in credit default swaps on these mortgage bonds. Can we make it a hundred million? Absolutely, we can make it one hundred million. You know I got it. If you wanna come get it, stand next to this money like. Elsa Mars to see Mr. Henry V. Gable. Miss Mars, Mr. Gable is the president of the World Broadcasting Network. He is overseeing over 12 weekly hours of programming, not including the news. He only sees people by appointment. And today, like yesterday and the day before, you don't have one. Look, my darling. I have some new headshots. Why don't you leave me the picture and the contact number? And I'll be sure he calls you as soon as he sees them. No. I'll wait. What is this, huh? Where's Mr. Gable? I did not see him pass through, and I would know him from his picture in the trades. He went out the back to avoid you. And you let me sit here like a fool all day? What kind of a place is this? Hollywood. If you ask me, change your act. Marlena did it better. What's going on? This crazy German broad has been coming in all week to see Mr. Gable without an appointment. She finally lost it. We've been, uh, trying a few new things. I got a cheerleading outfit. I peed a plus sign this morning. Oh, that's great. Oh, man. Uh, oh, you cheerleading. That's great. It's still really early, but you guys have all been so sweet, and we just felt like we had to tell you. I'm looking for someone. I think he works here. Cade LaSalle. Cade? God, I love that man. I gotta say, if I didn't have a husband and two under four at home, I would throw myself at him like a schoolgirl on prom night. You a friend? Brother. Yeah, I see that now. You know when he'll be in next? Oh, Kate up and left, end of summer. Must be three months now. He leave a forwarding address? <sighs> he didn't even say goodbye. You know, he still has a cashier's check in the back office. I can grab it if you want. Sure. When you see him, you tell him little Lena misses him. Will you? Breathe. 
that's a pretty good Beaujolais right there. Is it? Yeah. Depending on what you're going to drink it with. I probably won't drink it with anything. I'll take it. I'll take this. $19.99, please. Do you need a bag? No. Uh, that's 10. Okay. Thanks. 